welcome back, welcome back, welcome back to the A.S. Clem R. YouTube channel. So, in the first video we put out on Golf Plus, we did the front nine of the Castle Links. So today we're going to be doing the back nine. Now, I am recording this straight after the last one. It's the only two things I'm going to be recording tonight. Um, the front nine gave me a slight bit of a headache just because of how laggy it was in game on occasion. Um, I've literally turned everything off on my computer. I've made sure there's no background operations running. So hopefully there isn't going to be too much going on. Let me just double check that. Okay, so you can turn off. Yeah, there we go. That's everything sorted for now. Um, with that being said, please like subscribe 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 there is on average about 100 to 200 of you every month that join uh, yeah that join the channel we love you here we love you here we love you here the support on this channel has been nothing but excellent over the past couple of months so thank you we are on the road the road the road no we're on the way the way the way to 20k subscribers by the end of the year so we could easily do that we could easily do that like 30 to 40 percent of you no 40 to 50 percent of you aren't subscribed at this moment as of watching this so click that subscribe button for more golf plus content and more vr content in the future um i'm going to attempt to play this again and we're going to see how we go so without further ado let me get into the headset and change the audio again i don't think the audio was that bad i did have to soft speak because you couldn't hear the whispering but a quick confession before we get into this back nine i have just played it once didn't click record i then played pro put for about an hour i've come off and it, i've realized i haven't recorded so i am going to stand here just quickly adjust make sure i can swing and get back to ordinary so let's just recenter this no There we go, that's how we want it. Now, I have been ever so slightly resting on my foot. And we can now do full swings with a little bit more confidence. So, I want to make sure that I'm playing to the best of my ability. When I tend to drive, I either catch it very much on the heel. So, this side of the club. And it goes that way. Or I tend to slice it and it goes that way. It's not very often we get a straight drive, but 300 yards, it's 296 to the pin. We are 6.1 foot downhill, but the wind is in our favour. Maybe we can make this. Maybe we can make this. Let me just test. I'm not going to hit the wall. No, all good. There we are. So we do slice it ever so slightly, but hey, I'm going to take that. Now, in the first round we did, I got four, wow, the nine holes, seven bogeys, and two double bogeys. So the score itself wasn't too bad, but we didn't get a par. So at least for this, I can aim to try and get a par. Now, it's a half shot, but I'm going to go for a bit more of a lofted shot. So we're going to open the club face. We're going to do what I was doing last time, because we can get, quite, we can get through these rounds quite quickly. I want to look at the greens. Now, it isn't that bad. I have put it on pro greens, I'm pretty sure. But it does come back to myself. So there's a slight bit of a lack stop if we make it. Let's open the club face and go for a nice up and down. Oh, be good. Oh, too much spin, way too much spin. I could have gone for a little bit more with that, which is a bit of a shame. But as you can see, we're already getting better. So we're just going to go for a nice popping on. Let's pop it up in the air and get it onto the near the pin. Oh, what a shot. Now, like I did mention, I have been playing. Uh, I want it there, please. I have been playing a little bit of the pro putt, which is like the greens are really slow because it's basically mini golf. And I've been really enjoying that, uh, at least for the past hour anyway. So, I mean, you can see what time we're on. It's 10 to 2 in the morning, so I've got to be relatively quiet because the girlfriend is in bed. So here we go. Can we get par on the first hole? We can. There we go. So when I tried to record this, 
we didn't get a single par and we've already started off with quite a nice score now again if we quickly have a look on here that is 250 to there so maybe we want to be hitting it around there but the wind again is in our favor we just don't want to slice this because it might end up in the water and that is very hazardous for us so let's go oh it didn't quite pick it up let's oh very nice beautiful swing and now that i'm doing full swings you can tell that it is getting back to being good 277 swing very much in our interest uh, 218 to the pin and the eye in itself goes 218 with oh shit with the wind again in our in our favor a little bit so just a right okay so the one thing you need to know i did say this earlier um using irons in real life this is how it tends to go in real life for me my irons tend to go very straight but they never tend to get the distance so let's test this out nope it went very right definitely would have had the distance but we've ended up in the drink so let's just go back from where our last shot was and try and bring the club face in a bit and stop that slice no okay i'm quite close to my desk here i feel oh there we go i mean it still had a fade but you know what i'm going to take that oh the bounce oh the bounce was horrific not what i wanted right 14 yards to the pin again nice sandwich let's open up the face a little bit let's lean forward and try not to break my foot again oh what a shot <gasps> oh, no don't do it to me oh you oh it hasn't gone into the hasn't gone into the bunker but that my word what a shot i think i sort of topped it a little bit though so um what i might do is aim to land it around about here if you can see that and let it just trickle down towards the hole so here we go oh my god i couldn't have done it any better but again these greens are killing me oh this is not the start i wanted i genuinely i'd prefer to be more consistent i would i'd prefer consistency over anything let's go for a nice there we go oh has that actually bobbled over the hole? It has. You can see the little dint as it's gone over the hole. Had a bit too much pace. Oh, there we go, here we go, here we go. So what was we on the last round, so? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven over par, and we're already four. That's not how I want it to be. I mean, I didn't go one, 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 two, two. It was like the, the, the double bogus were sort of, I think, on the third. I think it was actually this one in the sixth hole. I think is where we got this. So, three, three, five to the pin, 300 yards drive. Um, if we have a look where the point is aimed, so we can get it to land around about here yeah i'll be happy with this a nice straight shot loop come on oh beautiful absolutely beautiful is it no it's not it's barely made it 200 yards i thought that was a good shot arguably not 110 with a sandwich so we're probably going to get to a nine iron or a kitchen wedge yeah we're going to do that and then we're going to go for a nice shot here there we go, a little bit right, distance seems to be, I was going to say nice, but we're on a bit of a hill, so I can't complain. Of course, it was always going to bounce back and roll back. Now, on a par four, third shot, let's have a look at this. Again, open the club face, I want it up and down. That's way too far. Oh, Luke, what have you done? Luckily, a bit of a backstop rolling back down this way so it hasn't gone too far here we go 
I feel like I've been on that golf game too much, that uh, pro putt golf game, the putting one too much because I don't think I'd ever hit like that last round. But you have to overcompensate when you're playing that mini golf game. Same there. Oh wow, what is that? Distance fine, not quite on the thing, so here we go. Again, is that another double bogey? It is a double bogey. Oh wow, so 165 to pin, 162 with an 8 iron. Probably going to double up and go for the 174 just because the distance doesn't seem to be too. I mean, the wind's in our favour, so I'm tempted to try it. Here we go. There's no arm in trying, eh? Again, a little bit right. I'm actually not too fussed with that one as long as it doesn't go bunk away. Oh, it has. And again, it's very short. What is it with me hitting these shots short? Um, I'm not going to open the club face because it seems to be doing me a bit of a disservice at the minute. But a nice... Oh, wait, hang on. We need to go like that. There we go. A little bit further from us. Oh, I've buffed it. There we go. Don't do it to me. Oh, you're having a laugh. I'm probably going to switch to a putter for this. Go for a nice, swift. There we go. That's got it. That's got the legs. Has it got the legs? It stopped turning. It's turning the other way. Oh. Another double. Right, we need to we need to regain focus on this. Now, slicing this isn't the worst thing in the world. Hitting it to that distance is probably about right, 250s. I think that averages out like your own sort of drive, so if I'm hitting it well, it will show me that I'll probably be able to get it further. But... Oh, it's sliced quite a bit, but you know what? We were left of the line anyway. Oh, I'll take that every day. I will take that every day. I thought that was heading more that way, but it wasn't. You know what? I cannot complain at that for a drive. I cannot complain. 97 yards and we hit this 110. The wind's pulling the ball a bit back, so let's try this. And a bit better this time. So here we go. And the reason that I keep the aim on is literally just because I'm holding and I'm gripping the, uh, the hand controls. So apologies for that. I'm not cheating in any way, I don't think. Oh, no, okay, don't don't make contact. Again, a little bit right, but I think that's probably the furthest we've got in terms of distance. Oh, be good. Spin back, roll down. Oh, that is by far, by far the best golf shot I've had on this game. Like I say, it started off a little right. The spin control was excellent. Now, can we get a very nice put here? I'm actually going to keep it relatively straight to the pin. I should have kept it straighter than that. I thought that was quite straight. Obviously not. Let's keep it going. Oh, new. Oh. Do you know what? I'm only letting myself down. I'm only letting myself down. That was our chance for birdie. And we've only gone and scruffed it. Here we go. Again. You can see my ball, my ball striking technique isn't the worst. Now that I'm twisting and I'm a little bit more confident on my feet, if I'm being honest. 263 drive, I'm very happy with. We are 61 to the pin with the wind back. 61 yards, so not a full swing, but then again, we don't want to we don't want to catch this one short Oh nice and straight quite high, so I don't think we'll get the distance unfortunately and it will spin because it's a very lofted club We have kept it short, which isn't which isn't the aim, but par four third shot. Let's try and get this one a little bit closer to the flag Oh be good and it's just rolled. But it's given us a good line to know that it's actually quite a straight shot. So if I'm going to do it, I'm going to go 
it might not look like I'm doing much by only moving it slightly to the ball but what it's doing is it's rotating us so I don't have to just keep rotating and losing where I am in the room which I hope I haven't thank you so be good oh it's turned more than I thought so the first one didn't turn very much and that one did trigger to hit okay nicely done and I notice we're not getting any lag so par double no par four double double bogey bogey in these next three I can only get I can only get one more bogey to equal last time score so we're gonna hope for a birdie now here we go I want to aim this slightly left actually oh no oh it has I've played a lovely draw but you know what I've done I've played a blinder I've played an absolute blinder what a shot so yeah typically I'm carrying 250 which I'm not too happy uh, not too unhappy with should I say it's 92 to the pin winds coming back on us let's go and take a look at that green because I saw a lot of red over there turn us around so I've got a bit of a backstop got a bit of a backstop so what I want to do is potentially with a nice bit of spin land it around here so let's go back to the ball here we go here we go here we go oh again I don't get how I get my club I don't get how I get it so high maybe I'm maybe I'm going through and flicking the wrist a bit maybe I just need to go and follow through a little bit better I don't know I don't know uh, 22 to the pin here we go oh be good keep rolling keep rolling 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 right maybe we can salvage par from this yes that's another par I'm happy I'm happy uh, it's a par three 142 to the pin 150 with the nine iron what I am going to do because I'm a little bit oh why's the power meter go there we go let's try this winds that way a bit which is not too bad because we tend to slice more than we draw as expected and distance now that it's a hundred percent actually tends to go where we're expecting it to go here we go here we go oh be good oh it's caught that edge it's caught the ridge oh don't do me like this no way that could have been so good it could have been so good this we're looking at bogey unless we can chip this in we're potentially looking at a double because putting this doesn't look easy it's too hard oh no I called it I called it we're gonna do it awfully oh no let's try this again be good oh my days I have rescued a double there because I forgot this was a par three and not a par bloody four. I'm what a chip in by the way. Can we just say my uh, short game has been nothing short of fantastic. Now, if we take a look at this, two fifty. Where's that? Oh God, no. We want to be aiming down there. I don't think I'm going to get it this far, so that bunker might be in play. But now we're hitting 100% 100, 100 shots, it might be alright. Am I hitting 100? Yes, I am. Here we go. I'm not quite comfortable here, let me just sit back. There we go. Up against the chair. In case a man then falls over in that. Oh, what a shot. Okay, okay. Happy, I'm a happy man. 
edge of the fringe. Come on, don't go into it. Mm, it's rolled into it, but I'm quite happy there. 81 to the pin. Where is that? Um, we're probably going to go for a sand wedge. Oh, okay. Okay, not a full shot. Then again, with the amount of spin we tend to get and the height we tend to get on this. Let's go over there. Take a look. So we have got a backstop. And if needs be, we are probably going to hit that. So here we go. Overly high. Hit that back edge. Spin back. Oh, I couldn't have called it any better. I couldn't have shaped that shot any better. Is this a par four? Boys, we might be on for a birdie here. We might be on for a bit. Let me adjust my goggles because they're rubbing on my nose a bit. There we go. Do it, do it, do it. No, are you mad? Look at that line. How was that not fell in? Oh, no. Hey, I'll take the par. Was that it? Was that was that the full nine? That was, I'll try to grab the flag then. Plus 12. Plus 12, how long have we been recording for? It's been 20 minutes, so I will show you what I've been working on in terms of the other game. Let's just have a seat. So look at these people with a, with a minus nine. What does that drop our handicap to? Let's take a quick look at the round summary. We've done well. Stats wise, so our tees, they're doing much better. The putting hasn't been great, admittedly. Green side's better, the approach has been fantastic. Plus eight strokes gained, so let's head back to the main menu. Have a look at my profile. Uh, where can we see a handicap? Our handicap's 36, so it has dropped. I'm quite happy about that. Uh, we've not done a total of 36 holes, unfortunately. First 18, I did off camera. Second 18, well, the first one we did. Second one we didn't because it didn't record. And then the third one, uh, we just sat and recorded. So... If we want to take a look at the mini games that I have been playing, so I'm going to go to Pro Put. I wanted to show you what it's like because it is fantastic. Uh, we can go in straight away and choose which hole we want to start at. So I'm probably going to show you the last three, so seven, eight, and nine. So this, hang on a minute. There we go. So if you hold the trigger button, it does show you the blue line, what you need to hit. Now you need to click the trigger on and off. So that won't hit the ball at all, look. With it on it will. But the power you need for this is outrageous. Look at that. And it will show you the perfect line you need. And if you get close enough to the hole, because it's mini golf, it will show you the line that's needed. So here we go. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Now you can see actually I'm oh, I'm 24th this week. Now what makes it better is you see this feet here. That's how far away from the hole you were on your second stroke. So you've got to get very close. Now how people have got one foot away from that, from around that bend, I've got no idea. But if you see this one, this one was a very tough hole for me when I tried it earlier. But again, we've made it before, we can do it again. Get plenty of speed, and you know what? That might be better than any attempt I did earlier, because that's going to fly past where the recommended is. It's going to sit very nicely on the run up to the hole, and we're going to see where we need to go. Now, I need to remember it needs a lot more pace than you'd think. Be good. Yes. First time. So remember, this was 21 foot away from there, which is why we're now 23rd this week. Um, two strokes how people are getting around three four away I've got no idea so if you come to have a look at this this is probably arguably the toughest one we've got there we go let's try that for size how are we doing get round be good get over that ridge and then we might stand the chance of doing it <laughs> so here we are oh it doesn't give me the line it doesn't think I can do it but I think last time I was here and we have to go up and around, so I'm just going to attempt the same. Not good enough, not good enough at all. Okay. Uh, 
Let's restart that one. Let's do that again because that was terrible. Oh no. Be good. Keep going round. It's a tough one. That's tough. If you land on the green, I found out. If you land on like the the, the, the dark green felt, it, it won't give you the line regardless of how close you are. Terrible, terrible hole. There we go, that's the shots I like. Be good. Don't think I'm close enough for that. That is awful. That's a bit better. Don't catch the edge. There we go, get a good roll. No, okay. Well, that's no good, is it? There we go. Get a good roll out of there. Get it? No, it's fallen. We'll try for a. We'll try for it just to see how we get on. I love it that way too hard, haven't I? Oh, that could be good. That could be very good. No. So anyway, I'm going to show you how I was doing it earlier. That was almost good. Oh my god. Come back down. Yes! Give me the line. Give me the line. It's giving me the line. No, I do want it there actually. Do this for me. You beauty! So as you can see we got the eagle. I think, and I'm not sure how far that put away was. 12 feet. Because I got one two feet away earlier and I'm fifth this week. Look at, look at my putts. That was actually the seventh best I've done. I'm trying to get the top spot, or at least top three. I've got to get it within 1.6. So we're going to have a few more attempts to try it. That definitely isn't doing it. There's two separate ways of doing it. One of them is to just shoot through the, that gap and catch, I'll show you which bit I'm on about. Catch this whole ridge and ride it really fast and towards the pin. The other one is to bump it over and try and get a nice run. So bump it, try and get a nice run down there, but arc it a little bit better than this. And I've had the most success out of doing it that way. Ooh. Nope, hit the tree. Here we go. Nope, too much. Right, let's have a quick two minute break for my feet because they're hurting a little bit. Try again, shall we? There we go. There we go. We've got one. No, we haven't. Didn't catch the edge. Oh, that's a shame. See, sometimes it slows down a lot when it hits this dark green felt. Sometimes not so much. Oh, that's horrific. That could be good. That could be good. That could be very good. What's that? Eight feet. Bang on eight feet. We'll put this one into the leaderboard. Eight feet. Still not as good as a top ten, though. Oh, oh, be good. Oh, be good. Slow, 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 slow. Oh, 1.8, 1.8, I've got this on camera. 1.8, puts us, oh, it puts us fourth. It puts us fourth, it'll readjust. Oh wait, 1.7, yeah. 
Oh, it puts us fourth. Let's go to friends. Let's go to weekly when it updates. There we go. We're fourth. And our actual score is only 700 off it. 650 off it. Oh. Oh, right. I'm having absolute fun with this game. It's been one of the best games I think I've ever played. And just look how long, look how red my cheeks have gone just because of how much I'm playing this. I'm really enjoying it. It's actually getting me up on my feet, which is very good. So, I hope you guys have enjoyed it. I'll catch you later.